Hello Libra. This is your ex reading for January 31st through February 6th. This is an ex reading again for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe, guys. Thank you. Let's see what's currently going on for you guys here. Hmm. I think a lot of you are irritated by, um, by something that has just recently happened. And I think, you know, you want to speak on it. You want to let somebody have it. You want to tell them exactly how you feel. And um, I feel like there's a level of anxiety here. Because it's like um, you've been holding your tongue is what I'm getting here. And a lot of you are really ready to like let it go. Alright. So let's see what their, your ex's current situation is here. Oh. Alright. Hang on guys. I got several car several cars that flew down here on the floor. Hold on one second. Hmm. So what flew out is a page of pentacles, the three of wands, the eight of swords, and the six of swords. A lot of you have, you know, it's like you were waiting on excuse me, on someone that you feel like is very childish and mature chore to come towards you and I think you've really been waiting on um, waiting on someone to kind of give you some information so you can move on is what I'm getting here it would have helped because I think you're moving on without it but I think you know that's really what you want to speak on here so let's see what your ex's current situation is the star. Hmm. This person's doing some healing, I feel. I feel like this person is, um, I think they're looking for you, honestly. Um, both of you guys are kind of looking back on the past. Um, strong Aquarius energy here. I feel like this person. Um, this person is in your life for a reason or they came into your life for a reason and I feel like uh, this is possibly meant to be your life partner of course we all have the power of free will so you know it's not set in stone but I feel like they're looking for you as well and they feel like I think you guys provide um, some healing energy for them they feel so much better when they're around you is what I'm getting okay let's see how you guys perceive your ex here they hold back a lot I think <laughs> a lot of you feel like they're they're like stingy too like they hold on to their money um, they keep things from you they don't reveal a whole lot like they're really not open with their emotions and they're really not that giving of their time either so um, you feel like they're closed off. Capricorn energy there. Hmm. Let's see what your ex ex's perception is of you. How does Libra's ex perceive them? Ace of Cups. Huh. This person feels like you're confident, but also this person, even if they're not showing you this, they have this this overflowing like love for you okay but i feel like it's one-sided this person love 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 loves libra but they don't feel that um you guys share this feeling of love with them and i think they are they're wanting you to open up as well they're wanting you to open up as well. But I think they get the impression that you are more focused on things that happened in the past and that you may not be so so willing to open up to them, okay? So let's see what your feelings are about getting back together here. What are your feelings about getting back together? Hmm. 
I think you definitely see potential here. Gemini energy. I think that you guys probably would like um, a little more attraction to this person, a little more chemistry going on. But I, I feel like you're considering, you're considering this. Okay. I think you're in the process of choosing, but there, there's some things that you need to know. Is what I'm getting here. There's something that you need to know. That's probably going to um, influence, you know, what you do here. Let's see what your ex's feelings are about getting back together. Hmm. Taurus energy. I feel like this person wants to get back for sure, but they don't know if if you're gonna run out on them. They don't know if you know if you guys got together if you would leave them. If you would give them the time um, that they feel like you know it takes to to build a relationship, they're not sure that you will be all in. They're scared that you're gonna hurt them. They're they're very scared that you're gonna hurt them. I leave your friends, okay? Let's see how you guys can increase the chances of reconciliation here. Be more loving. Be more open. Um, offer your love. If you guys have been kind of cold and aloof and, you know, just really kind of, you know, not offering this per person any emotion, um, the advice would be to open up. Open up. Let them know that you care. Because I get the feeling that they're very, they love you to death. But they're scared that you're going to hurt them, that you're going to leave them. Okay. Let's see how they can increase the chances of reconciliation here. Hmm. They need to make themselves happy. Okay. They need to find happiness within themselves. Once they find happiness within themselves, then they can have their wishes fulfilled here. Because we have the Nine of Cups and the Star. You guys are definitely their wish. But I feel like there's some work that they need to do here on themselves and build up to this Nine of Cups where they feel complete within themselves. Then they can have this at this Ace of Cups to this Nine of Cups and have the Ten of Cups, the ultimate fulfillment in a relationship with you guys. But they have to work on themselves here, okay? So let's see what the potential outcome is for you guys here. What is the potential outcome for Libra? The potential outcome for Libra. Seven of Wands. Huh. I feel that I feel as though um, for this week, anyway. That you guys are still going to, you know, be really standoffish with this person. Um, I, I feel that you don't really see being with them um, as being something that will be successful. Um, I think they're very attracted to you. But I think you're fighting them. Like, you're fighting this start with this person. And, and I don't know whether you're picking up on the fact that they're not happy um, or whether there's some issues that you guys really need to address from the past even. But I think, you, you know, you're, you're blocking them energetically, okay? And I feel they feel that. And that's why the Five of Pentacles is here. Because they feel that, um, you know, you guys will not be there for them, you know, through thick and thin regardless. That there are stipulations with the connection, that you are liable to walk out at any given time, okay? But right now, I don't even think that um, you're willing willing to let them in fully, okay? So we have Leo here, um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio maybe, Taurus, Gemini, um, Capricorn, Aquarius energy, okay? 
So that's what I have for you guys, and I will be speaking with you soon.